What's up YouTube? Today I'm going to be changing an external light fixture. Uh, I'll show you the fixture right now. That's actually a light fixture. Should be super easy to change. I think it's three wires. I'll get to it. This is actually a light fixture that I'm going to be changing it into. It's just plain white fixture. But uh, they sell motion light sensors or motion sensor lights. Motion sensor lights. Anyways, you get what I'm trying to say. But they're about $50 a piece and... Uh, I found this one for about 10 bucks and then I found the smoke should activate light. These are about $10 a piece, but, uh, for the price I'm paying for these, I'm going to be able to change the light bulb about four more times and it'll still be the same price as just using a motion sensor light. Anyways, I'm going to get to it. Okay. So the first thing you're going to want to do is, uh, turn off the power to either that switch. If you don't know what switch it is, just hit your entire main breaker and it'll turn off the power to your entire house. Let's go do that first. This is your breaker box. That's your main breaker. That's my main breaker, actually. I can either shut that off, but uh, I just know, I already know what, like I've worked on this house enough. I know what breaker controls that switch. So uh, it's actually this one, so shut that off. Now let's get to work on the light. Okay, so I got a step ladder. Uh, first thing I'm gonna do is take these two screws out. There's one on each side. They're Phillips screw, I mean, uh, flathead screwdrivers. So let me do that real quick. So if I could go back and say anything or start this process over, I would say uh, remove that glass bulb. That glass bulb actually fell and broke down there. That's glass everywhere. Um, that's actually it. This is the light bulb. The light bulb looks like it was shortened out. Not very safe. Not sure what it looks like that. Maybe old, maybe no idea. Anyways. Once you get this removed, those screws removed, that's what your bracket underneath is going to look like. You're going to have a white wire and a black wire, then your ground wire. Kind of ghetto the way I have this rigged up. Anyways, so if you look at the new light, that has a brand new bracket. It's the exact same bracket that's already on there. I don't have to remove it and replace it, but I'm going to just so I can just use this new one anyways. Plus, I'm, to I'm tossing all the old shit. So before you install your new bracket, you want to tighten this nut right here down so this stud doesn't move. So after you replace your bracket, you're going to have a white and a black wire coming from inside your house. As you're going to have a white and a black wire coming from the new light fixture. You just make sure those match. Inside your new packet, you're going to have these. These actually come in their own little separate packet. But it comes with your light, your new light fixture. And these little twist nuts are what you're going to use to connect your wires. I'll show you right now. So you connect your wires and just uh, twist these on there. If you look inside here, you can see a little ring. You just twist them on like you would a cap. Like a cap to a pop. So just twist those together. I just have mine hung off this one stud make sure it doesn't move and then connect your ground and then tighten this so this thing doesn't move and then connect your ground just ground your ground wire out that's gonna be hanging off the back of this i probably shouldn't have this hanging but anyways uh and then just tighten that so it's level so it doesn't move okay and i ended up having to go back and adjust these nuts a little so the stud doesn't stick out so far but now it's ready to be put on. Everything's ready, ground's in, wire's connected correctly, securely. All right, all right. That's what it should look like when it's installed. It's actually really simple. But the coolest thing about this is that I found this motion activated light. Works as a motion sensor, light, whatever. Anyways, I'm gonna put this in and we're pretty much done. There's a potato. 